What's going on, everybody? My name is Chris, the Chaos Gamer, and I want to say I'm sorry. I want to apologize for the lack of videos for the last month and a half. I just want to flat out say that first. Um, before I get to the reason why, because I try, I try to be transparent with you guys, I try, and I'm not one to make up lies, because that's just not the kind of person that I am, but, um, usually before, my reasons for not posting videos are usually the same, like, I got busy, or I forgot, or whatever, but the reason why they're, they're like I'm not even putting any music in this video like that this is how serious I'm being for those of you who know the kind of person that I am personally I am I am a selfless person I care about others before I care about myself kind of thing and the reasoning for my lack of videos for the past month and a half has been because of that reason because someone close to me i'm not going to say who i'm not going to say what happened but a person close to me got really sick and because of this my lack of motivation for doing videos just was just steadily decreasing and it took uh, a turning point in uh, february this year where this uh sickness came back and now they're doing now don't get me wrong they're doing fine uh they're <laughs> they're still alive and kicking thank god but because they got sick my lack my my lack of motivation uh was dropping especially for doing videos and even my twitter presence uh have even dropped and i want to apologize for that but like i said my my motivation was what what took a took a huge dip and i should have said something beforehand but you know life goes on and life just slaps you in the face with 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 no um with with no warning beforehand and that's kind of what happened. So, like I said, my lack of motivation kind of took a dip. Uh, that's why that's one of the one of the reasons why Snakewood hasn't been updated in like what two months, and why my draft league videos stopped after what week seven of twelve. So, I'm here to let you guys know that I'm still alive. My motivation is coming uh, my motivation is back i've been wanting to do I've, I've been wanting to make a comeback for i say for probably about two or three uh two or three weeks now so it hasn't been quite a month um and i've been even i've even been slowly uh, uh getting on the twitter uh thing again so my motivation is coming back but i wanted to do it in such a way that I just don't randomly just start posting videos again. I wanted to do something like this first. So, um, so everything is relatively back to normal, which is, which is good. Um, but now, uh, the state, now I mentioned Snakewood and Draft League videos. So let me just start that. Now that, you know, now that I'm, now that I'm back and kicking and motivation is back and I want to get videos done, damn it. Okay. <laughs> this is what happens when, uh, when I just turn on the camera and just say, go. Okay. So first, first I want to take, top take, I want to talk about Snakewood. So... As you guys know from my previous um, update videos, I hate the fact of ending a series early. I really do, because it's almost like it's almost like you're eating a real. It's almost like you're eating a eating a sandwich, and you're not full, but you don't finish that sandwich. It's like obviously you have to finish the sandwich, but you can't for whatever reason you can't. 
for Snakewood, it wasn't so much that I can't. It's so much more I don't want to. Um, because ever since, I don't remember what episode it was, but the part of Snakewood in which I started losing complete and utter loss of motivation to play was i think there was like a series uh, there was like a series of like three or four episodes in which i was stuck in the same area uh I, it was like the um it was like the, it was the isle of something it was um you guys remember the one where i was doing i was going through the cave it was like a mountain and i was going through the caves and there was only one right answer and if you don't you get sent all the way back that was the part that was telling me that I should have stopped because after because after that part I stopped having fun the puzzles were especially that area that area alone and there's another area too which I will get into but that area with the mountain, the Isle of whatever, that wasn't fun. Because there were so many ways to go wrong and you get sent back all the way to square one. You could be playing for 20 minutes and then all of a sudden you're back to the beginning. And you have to do the whole damn thing all over again. To me, that's not fun. To me, that's not a puzzle. Like, don't get me wrong, the, the whole, like... The part of the game where it was the hidden, uh, the hidden maze with the with the with the table right in the middle, that was fine to me. But the caves, that was monotonous. And the other the other part of Snakewood that I didn't like was the puzzles in the the submarine, in which you had to catch a magnemite and a ditto. Who? who i i had to look those up in bet in between episodes i had to look up how to activate the elevator and how to unlock the door with no explanation that you had to catch a magnemite and you had to catch a ditto to me that's not that to me that's not a puzzle anyway the game started to the game was not fun to me the puzzles were mundane uh, um what's the there's a word i'm looking for i want to say it's mundane but that's not the word i'm looking for and even with the area and i know i'm close to the end of the game i know i am but with what i've said before with me not having fun with the game plus for whatever reason the e the the xp gain in victory road is so low grinding for 10 levels on on the entire team i would have to play not even for a full day i would have to play for like a whole week every day for a whole week just to get everyone up to where i should be for the Elite Four. Now I know I kind of held my own with the first, what was it, two? Maybe three? But I was struggling. And being the low level that I was, the ex the grinding for in Victory Road felt like a chore. And again, alluding to the fact, again, that, you know, I, I wasn't having fun. So up until now... Snakewood is finished. Um, like I said before, I hate having to finish to end a series early, but it was going on for so long. I think we were up to like episode six, like over 60. I think we were like 64, 65. And over half of those videos were making literal little to no progress because of the amount of puzzles and monotony that's in the game now kudos to the creator of the game because the story was fine 
The story was good. The puzzles, though, the puzzles were dumb, monotonous, and it felt like a chore. So kudos to you, though, uh, from cre- for creating a Pokemon uh, ROM hack that, you know, that may- that had the, what was it, the, the Seven Horsemen of the Apocalypse and zombies and all that stuff. Oh, speaking of the zombies, the Snorlaxes, but you guys already knew that frustration anyway. Next, we're going to talk about UPBA Season 3. So I know I haven't posted since Week 7. What I'm going to do is I'm going to do a massive video in which I post the replays of every match after Week 7 up to when we stopped. The reason I said when we stopped was because we ended up making playoffs. That was probably the most hyped I've ever been in a draft league before because we actually made playoffs. Now we lost in the we lost in the first round, but we still made playoffs for the first time. It actually had to come down to the week 12 match to determine that I was going to make it in or not. So I was hyped about that and I was kind of sad that I wasn't motivated to record anything. But like I said, what I'm going to do is I'm going to make one big massive video with weeks 8 through, um, I guess, weeks through 8 through eight, uh, 13, I guess, because playoffs, because we did one battle of playoffs. And and we'll see what you guys think. I won't post the sets because I don't have them anymore, but I'll post the replays and you guys can give your suggestions for moves or whatever in, in the comments. Um, I'll make an announcement on Twitter when I'm doing that video because it will take a little bit of preparation because I have an idea with what I want to do. So that's that. And we are doing UPBA season four, uh, week one battles start next week. Actually, we already got, we just finished drafting just a couple of days ago. So the St. John Sharpedos are back. We will be start we will be recording i will try and get every video done this time i know i didn't in season two or um i know i didn't in season two and i know and i and my lack of motivation uh in season three kind of kind of took a hit there too i would have done it if my motivation was was there but season four we are back i will record them with a little bit of more hype and energy now i may go quiet in a couple of video uh, in a couple of battles because uh i tend to think better when i'm not talking for whatever i guess this is normal thinking i guess but at least then you'll get my reactions to when plays are made or whatever so upba season four is back uh we will be back next week with that i believe next saturday I'm going to try and put myself on a schedule for those battles so that then it just doesn't pop up out of nowhere. So I might just do it so that it's at the end of the week uh, of the battling week, which would either be Saturday or Sunday. So at least then you guys got something to look forward to then. Next, because I'm ending Snakewood early, I am going to be... Uh, I am going to be starting my next project. It is a Pokemon project, so don't worry about that. I'm still a Pokemon-based channel. Don't forget that. Uh, but we will be starting, I will be starting my next project, uh, not this weekend, but I will start recording them next weekend. Uh, I'm going to try and get them released, uh, the same days that Snakewood was being released, which would be Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. Um, if I can swing another, if I can swing another day, I might do, uh, I might do an extra upload, say either Tuesday or Thursday. I don't want to. I don't want to do it every day because, um, at least then I got myself a day to do a buffer in between each episode. Uh, because I typically do bulk recordings instead of just upload and, or record and then upload. Because there is a little bit of editing that's go in there, and my computer takes like two hours to render one video. So, um, I'm not gonna say what the project is but it's not a rom hack and it's not a main series game but it is a game in which i have never played it's been a series that was suggested to me 
uh, about six to eight, about eight months ago, eight months ago to a year, it was suggested to me because we, we were talking about it one day before on Discord and a guy was like, you should play, well, you like these series of games, you should play it. Um, the only hint I will give you is that we will be on the uh, the fee, uh, the feel train. That's the only hint I'm going to give you. Uh, so if I can get a date here, we will start on the 14th of May. On the 14th of May will be episode one of my next project. So be on the lookout for that. I'm excited for it. Because it's it's a series that I haven't done before. It's a Pokemon ser it's a Pokemon series I haven't done before, and it's blind too. And because I haven't done it before, I can actually do. I want to change a little bit on my commentary a bit, because I know before. Well, you guys saw a little bit in Snakewood, um, but you guys will hopefully will see more of it in. Um, in this new project so be on the lookout for that i'm excited for it and you should be too um i think that's everything that i want to talk about so and for twitch streaming i want i really 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 want to start twitch streaming but i'm not sure how i want to start it yet like do it regularly i want to put myself on a schedule for all I know, I might want to do it in such a way that I do it on the opposite day that I'm uploading a video maybe. So maybe Tuesdays and Thursdays and maybe an extra one on Sunday. I'm not 100% sure yet, but I will make uh, I will make a post on Twitter when I have that decided. So please follow me on Twitter if you haven't yet uh, and all that good, wonderful stuff. So I know it's been – I know I've been rambling for a while now. Uh, so I'm going to get out of here and yeah so i hope you guys enjoyed the video if you guys enjoyed it please let me know in the comment section uh as well as give me a thumbs up and if you have any lack of and you know what i usually do a question of the day i got one i got one for you guys what i'm not gonna i'm not i'm not asking for, i'm not asking for specifics but at what point, or if you had a lack of motivation, what did you do and how did you overcome it? That's, the, that's my question of the day. And if you guys are excited for the next series, please leave that, please leave that series a thumbs up and leave comments because I'm going to put questions of the day on every video that I do. Probably except for draft league videos because that one's more competitive than anything else. But I'm going to get out of here because I've been rambling for too long. If you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to give this video a thumbs up because your support is greatly appreciated. And let's start a conversation. So give me – so uh, put all your question of the day answers in, in the comment section and let's have a conversation and all that good wonderful stuff. I've been Chris the Cast Gamer, and I will see you guys in the next episode. It's good to finally be back. I'll see you guys next time.